Europe leads 5-3 at the end of day one at the Ryder Cup, but with the way things ended here at Glen Eagles, the advantage felt much greater. After a defeat this morning, Rory McIlroy and partner Sergio Garcia rallied in the late afternoon foursomes to defeat two of the more informed players here, Jimmy Walker and Ricky Fowler. They only have the match, but with a birdie birdie finish that included a monster 40 foot putt from Rory McIlroy on 17, this is shaping up to be one of those momentum shifts the Ryder Cup is famous for. It meant that Europe took three and a half of a possible four points, killing off any momentum the U.S. built up in the morning. Jamie Donaldson and Lee Westwood started things by holding off Jim Furyk and Matt Kuchar, America's would-be foursome specialist, to win by two holes. While Justin Rose and Henrik Stenson posted their second point of the day with a two-and-one win over Hunter Mahan and Zach Johnson. And as the light faded over Glen Eagles, Keegan Bradley and Phil Mickelson finished their day by slumping to a three-and-two defeat against Victor Dubuisson and Graham McDowell. On Saturday, the action continues. For Saturday morning's four ball, Europe captain Paul McGinley has taken an if it ain't broke, don't fix it approach. Three of his pairings are the same as Friday. The only change is that he's sending out McElroy with Ian Poulter. Tom Watson has done a little more reshuffling on the American side with two new pairings, but he left Patrick Reed and Jordan Spieth together after that duo of rookies blew away the competition on Friday morning. 